Okay, let's try this again. This has been an unfortunate morning for recording. So I'm like, I was gonna do this like really early, you know, like, cause I woke up like, like I woke up around her like about six. So I'm like going to work and she let the cat out. And she's like, feed the cat. So I fed the cat. Ooh, fed the cat. And then, uh, you know, get off breakfast, and it was like, okay, let's go up and start recording. <laughs> Mr. Makoto Nagi. <laughs> I'm glad she agrees that she pointed that out it too. Yeah, you, you are a nuisance. Heard a crash come down, you know, Vias has been tipped over, they didn't break or anything, it's just lying on the side on the worktop. Floor is covered in water and flowers, and someone's sitting there looking at me like he's all innocent. So that was fun. And then just, while I was in like, the anger at having to do all that shit, just fucking... <laughs> A waver in her voice, that's adorable. Remember this guy is just... Oh yeah, I'm glad to. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> voice actors is putting in the work at least. Oh, poor Kamaru. So yeah, I had to clean all that up and... Then while I was in a rage... Rage. Well, I was like all, all like fucked up and annoyed. I just went around and cleaned like the rest of the kitchen. You know, dumped out a lot of rubbish in the recycling bin, in the actual bin, empty bins, clean stuff off. Because you know, we basically just leave it until like if it's built up over a day, we'll just leave it until some point during the next day. The empty, oh, I didn't empty. I just remembered. I was like bag of like rib bones. I don't think I emptied in the bin because I had ribs for dinner last night. Hello. You fucking nuisance. Now <laughs> oh, they're probably dead, aren't they? <laughs> it was never gonna be that easy, was it? Probably start focusing on the game instead of bitching about my day because I can do that during the gameplay segments. You know, basically, it's. it's... I, I'll, I'll wait. I never thought I'd hear you be happy about something. He's overly fond of, like, sniffing and poking at the Switch games. What do you mean? <laughs> like, what do you mean, like, what do you mean by that? Like, how is she meant to know you did this? She's been, like, fucking sealed up for, like, a year. Or however long it is. Or long it's been, or whatever the fuck. Well, she said a year and a half. It's, what was it? It's been like. Okay, no, no, I'm mixing things up. I was like, one like, but you know, thank you, Rob, but she had like a missing two years and all that. But all this shit didn't happen until like those two years came to an end, so it's fine. It's fine. The, you know, it has like the exclamation mark and question mark. It makes it sound louder than she actually says it. <laughs> I mean, 
considering you didn't even give her like her own fucking uniform or like any other actual clothes or anything, I don't think you care that much. I mean, case in point. You didn't. I'm kind of wondering why you didn't. <laughs> she just too awkward to say. die here. He should, but he's not going to. You, you're intent on making my life a shit today, aren't you? Cause now you're going climbing because I have you closed <laughs> in here with me. Try and minimize noises. No, you're not allowed to hide the TV. You'll knock things over or get, or get stuck and start screeching. No. Why are you pawing it, Kamaru Shadow? Why are you doing that? He's just... S s Sweeping the screen with her shadow. No. Get back. Oh yeah, how could he ever be fucking incompetent besides the fact that he always is? They understand that's not that uncommon for like noble families in these things, isn't it? Signs you don't know? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> She's getting annoyed at Tonko. <laughs> Oi, don't you dare. He's shoving that wee thing off to knock it over. <laughs> this is where you explain the plot of Banger Mapa 1. Bop you on the nose, you keep trying to shove stuff off. I, however, didn't do any killing because I'm hardcore. <sighs> I'm sick of the word despair. <laughs> I don't remember this old news building thing. I guess this is an overlay.
外の世界へと出て行ったんだけど外の世界は想像以上に大変なことになってて正直僕らは何度も言ってたけどそれでも一緒に生き残った仲間と支え合うことで何とか前へと進むことができたんだキャブルヘッジヘルそれからしばらくして僕らは未来機関に保護されそれをきっかけに未来機関に所属することにしたんだあの事件が終わってもなお絶望を広めようとしている絶望の残党と戦うためにね So is more past the dang and rumpa too lot? I mean, Nagy had to be like dragged along into doing that. I mean, he mostly just didn't do that, but you know. I'm glad he acknowledges it at least. Yeah, I don't think he's changed a bit either, honestly. Luigi's fighting a bag on the floor. I apologize for this, but I... If I don't keep him in here, I get nagged. I mean, if you say so, Kamaru. It's not really something you need to apologize for, you dipshit. Everyone did have someone more, except for your man. I guess if that like murder of Chihiro hadn't happened, this would be what would happen. They want to have everyone here. Does the second killing game?
Oh my god. Mm. Cat. <laughs> Please. Setup. Excuse you. Well, no shit, that just should be like the most obvious thing you. Where's Kyoko? Like, he's helpless without her already. Massacre game. You only just catching on to that now? See how that's currently relevant, Toko. of the spur is that you're just cleaning up her aftermath and all the people she like touched and changed so is it not really like, all that much of a surprise that they're referring to her you get to hear this background soundscape of my life that's the point you catch on to. <laughs> what if it was another fake? I think that's my sister I haven't run out the door now to work, so I can probably open my door again. Part where he says he can't. Huh? 
ガキどもがなんで白夜様を人質にしたと思ってるの未来機関を介入させないために決まってるじゃない銀行強盗の人質と一緒抑止力としての人質よつ,つまり未来機関が東亜シティに来たら白夜様の命が危険にさらされるってことよじゃあ未来機関は助けに来られないのだったら私はどうすればいいの Oh, I gotta go see if Biakio because these are useless piece of shit. She got a stun gun. You're already taking out two, what's another three? You've already taken out two big robots, you stupid shit. Jamming has been raised. I mean, they basically already knew you were here. Screamy child, what is with you? Also, well, you got a thing on your nose. You're plucking at the polystyrene. Don't just sit down there, I'm sitting there. <laughs> I'm sitting there. <laughs> Fine, sit with me. Not in a good way. Oh, we got a light. Sits there. 
You can do that? Ah, she's walked in the paint. Saw it as a table. Huh. <laughs> Toko, please. This is kind of funny though. Like the kids run across like tabletops and shit. So you just have to like navigate around by what you can see and all that. Ah, of course. Hell is this? Well, it's not quite the floor's lava, they can quite make that jump by themselves. Hmm. That's not the wrong button. Not the wrong button. That's the wrong button. It's nice and they give you the heads up always. I think it's been a bit more generous with the eye hitboxes than it is with it. Or maybe it's just easier because all you see is the red light, so you just point at the red. There's some book shit about socks, isn't there? Oh, I have lost the trail. Oh, you're going to regret that. Did I get this self destruct? I was wondering when these would come back. Oh,方は簡単だ。まずは普段通り洗濯をしろ。そうか。普段通り洗濯します。それを進む際に水を溜めてやってみる。その溜めた水の中にビールを少量加えるんだ。No, <laughs> that's a really good way to ruin your fucking clothes. It'll also be slimy and smell like fucking like alcohol. <laughs> Are you okay, Toko?
Look at the fucking eyes rolled in their hair. Oh. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's also a dead kid on the other side. It's okay, Kamar. It's, it's okay. Now we don't need the light anymore. Top of a building, like a tower. You realize that, right? something. It was like an emergency evacuation thing. It's the red void of buildings. I don't doubt this game will let you fall. Well, what do you know? There's a ladder. Considering some of the shit it pulled of like the water bits. I mean, like letting you be blown off into them. I think there's probably something the other way, isn't there? I don't care. I'm not going back for it. Or sky out of like 30. I guess it's to show that Toko does have a climbing animation. I was wondering where these. No funeral <laughs> this time. I'm gonna guess by the title of this chapter, it's. Fuck's her name. The pink haired one. Are you really bothered by this? Kotoko? Like she's doing the, the shocked face with the sweat drops where it's like What are you doing? I don't understand. This is disturbing. But... You're just... How are you having the, the beginning... How are you the one who's beginning to go like, Well, this is fucked up. What's happening? Like... We're among like, the most relentless and bloodthirsty of the, of the five of them. in the corner, the picture on the side. Okay, come on, fuck you. I don't believe for a second this one is beginning to have doubts about this. Why do you give a shit? No, you didn't give a shit when the other one died.
Well, it's because you know it's your turn next? Like what? This is an animation, alright? Christ, their eyes. Like, why? I don't. But, like, I could get Nagasa beginning to, like, you know, have his dice because he seems like the smart one. And he's like, oh, I don't know about this. I don't believe Little Miss Psychopath here, with her constant, like, fucking pedophilia jokes, is the one who would suddenly have her dice. Mailboxes are always white in Japan. I don't know, I'd worry about the mailbox thing. Gentle. Why is that highlighted? I guess fair play to them. I generally expect that this would be a sort of thing they would like, you know, shy away from because, like, yeah, but that's too dark. We can't do that. But here they are. They like, fuck me. You've actually gone that far. This why she was. Okay, I guess you could have guessed that she would have this concern. She's constantly talking about pedophiles. Fucking her into the crowd of monokuma kids, I guess. You mean the way you're scarring her eye? Uh. 
they're not gonna have the balls to do it because they have the balls to reference you know like child's abuse and like fucking pedophilia and shit they're not gonna have the balls to have Toku fucking jam a scissor straight into this girl just fucking got her like a fish even though she fucking deserves it Monica I mean I don't know if like the whole, cause you know it's children, so they go and they make the childish poop jokes, and it's like okay, but I don't know. If it's like it's kind of like, does that detract or does that kind of fit the whole discordant tone that I just noticed in the background? I mean, either they didn't want to depict it with a bruised face, or Monica, despite the noise of that, can't actually hit for shit. <laughs> Are we not going to address the, the bear in the background? Aren't you like social studies? How the hell do you know how to do that? Music taking a bit of a loopy return. Some skill to be able to spin on the spot <laughs> fucking wheelchair. <laughs> this silence I've been wondering when this guy would come into things I 
okay then. Hero is still in child phase, but warrior alien brother already showed up. Is that a reference to? Hero is still in child phase, but warrior alien. Is that Dragon Ball Z? Is that Goku and Raditz? Is that the end of a golf club in the hat? I mean, that looks like one of the court chairs from the trials, but what's your deal? Are they going to send Kurokuma after us? Like what? Did he really climb all the way down that fucking tower? How is the water if you're in the tower? Oh wait, no, the fish tanks. Is that where we are? I guess it must be. Oh no, that's like ages below? Is just like way further below. It just looked closer than I thought it was. And it just looked closer than it is, rather, in the cutscene. <laughs> Try holding out a bit longer. Uh, you say something. Yeah. Hmm. Well, what does this mean? Well, it looks like doorways. I'm expecting it to immediately just crack off again. <laughs> Find the light in the darkness. Call yourself a pig, Toku. Yeah, you did talk. I feel like this matters. There's a room next door or something to do, as she said. Big door here and a door there.
So it's two five oh seven, not one nine one nine oh seven. I don't think I'm gonna have to tell you to use the damn attack, but I know. I mean, I guess the, the assumption should just be that it's the ones that are against this wall, right? So that's like the what? The 2 5 ooh, 7, isn't it? Understanding it then. Locker. Oh, and they gotta move the lockers into the place. I wonder if you can move the lockers before you do the thing wrong. This tells two one nine seven. Okay. I wonder if you just put the code in if there's like you know dialogue for just getting it exactly right. One nine seven. <laughs> she wanted to tell the story. Oh, this won't even work. Whatever. deal with them exactly, but hey, at least all that happened was I got rubbish on my face. What did that not even hit? Not the bag. Isn't this like one of the drawings towards like a kid battle arena? Like, that was like the way it was the first kids one. Puzzle room at least then. Gotta want to hide the seat. The one hiding is a good singer. Songs are good. When that song is sung, Beast goes crazy. With song and Beast overheats Kablooey. With lots of beasts wandering around. Uh, 
I just didn't trust in it being audio only, or they figured that just in case someone can't hear it properly. Which is nice. It's nice of them to consider that. You say that, but if you get them all lined up, then fucking Genocider just eats them alive. Anyway. Three there, and there's three patrolling. One goes up, two goes up, and of course, three goes up. Okay, so the pattern is one goes the full length, then the next one follows, and the next one follows, and back over to that side. I can't really tell by audio alone. I also don't really know what the circle means. Right? The music's not really emu like emanating from this. I've got pretty good headphones for this shit. And for this to pass. So you'd think that means right, right? Because it's like gray and then yellow for when you're correct because you're near. Okay, this has to be it, right? Yep. Marginally satisfying. What the fuck? Stay on. It was an interesting we challenged that one. Come on, that's totally in his eye. What's the message from him, I guess, with his dying breath.
Thank God. We can kind of do a few more knockback shots, honestly. If you know what I mean. And maybe that'll give me them. Hey. Back on the main streets of Toa City. I what? What do you mean, what's with that? They know you're there. Unless you take out the kids and their jamming equipment. Really call yourself Raider after you put two kids to death? I'm pretty sure that's riding. Point of this? They threw a motherfucker in there, but I appreciate it. Great. <laughs> you high bastard? Oh. <laughs> Thank God. He's the advisor. This is vibrating. How is it meant to advise anyone if all it does is rant about its own ego? 
簡単な話さ。あいつは秘密基地を叩くんだよ。え秘密基地の場所が分かったんですかああ、安全だと思っていた秘密基地が襲われれば、あいつら慌てて巣穴から飛び出してくるぞ。そして、巣を失った蟻
タはね、散々人に甘えてばっかりで。何もしてなかったって。You certainly seem to think you've done nothing. Like, where the hell is this steel coming from? Except Biakia for some baffling reason. Damn. Damn. <laughs> Zoku isn't wrong with the first bit, at least. Nah, but then basically no one did, and rightfully so. <laughs> this is the warrant actually gonna get like a split thing going on then. Yep, yeah, but seriously though, like, this whole time Kamari's been like, well, I can't do this, I can't do that, there's nothing I can do, I can't fight. But now she suddenly has to steal to realize that, yeah, she actually has done and achieved things, but only fucking now. Like, I hope that actually stays. Like, I don't know entirely where it came from, I guess she just finally wised up. After Toko's shit, saying she'll kill her for trying to bring the future foundation in and all that. I guess it's more health up. Yeah, no, heating item boost. I've got the space to spare. Hmm. But yeah, no, she has been achieving shit, she just hasn't acknowledged herself until nigh, I guess. And I hope that she does start acknowledging it now, because fuck it, frankly. <laughs> ah, the awkward silences. Where are we going? Goes into the puzzle room then. Eh, we'll go for a bit longer, fuck it. Next save point or something. Dance bullets. New bullet type? Nope. Monarch man. Monarch man. I'm very fond of the challenge thing in this chapter, I'm noticing. All of one explosion. Hmm. Is there a catch? Because like the way I'm seeing it is just you walk up there, you lure that one in, you shoot him, and then he just fucking kills everyone else.
scythe, standard sword. I guess that's the little artist kid. This guy looks like a tit. And which? Uh, it's the Chan of Rooms, okay. Let's see what the challenge framework was, because it's not like any of these are ever optional. She ducks and panics even though this gun can't hurt her. Move and dance. So, I guess it's trying to determine what order I do it in. Do I hit this one, then make him dance, and then set him up? That I will like bring these two around the corner to him. Is that how that works, or do I have to make him dance and then hit this so all of them move towards that, and then the car? <sighs> Access either or. I guess it depends on like, the range of him versus on you know, the sideline of it. Well, I guess you could like shoot this and dance, and that would bring. Uh, we'll do that one. Sorry, Doko. <laughs> Figured. Because he didn't move even though that was tapping me in front of him. So I guess these are like strictly line of sight. You had to be facing it. Huh. Are these the demons, I guess? These two over here just being tits. Ah. Ah, okay. Okay, all of one explosion. Hmm. Move and break. Anything can move. Maybe we had some, but I don't think they're like they're just regular monokumas. Yeah, okay, no, they're the we the ones with the mustaches. Okay. So it has to be I guess you gotta like shoot him. You gotta like kill him dead center and then his explosion will blast the ice two towards the others. Is that it? Is it kill them all with one explosion? So Am I missing something? Ball. Alright then. Kill them all with one explosion. The only bullets I can use are brick and move. Nothing in the environment, is there? 
I wonder what the Japanese text for these little RPG boxes says. I guess they couldn't bother making like new ones in English and all that. I mean, I guess, fair enough. Shoot him in the back while he drop his bones and that will blow up or I might find out. I don't know how that technically counts as one explosion, because I had to shoot the one guy until he blew up. I had to like shoot him in the back several times until he just fucking died. Is brick boat still in here? Nah, the fear is. Huh. Didn't see that before. Struck my son. Whatever. Skeletons, treasures, exploring cave, the fight dragon, kill dragon. And then everyone praised by Queen. Hey. You understand science, right? Fitting, I guess. All right, they rescue the queen, and then everyone happy. Is that what this is about? Is it like this is just like their plan, I guess? Such as it is. Well, that's obviously gonna spring up. What's your deal? one of these people who despite having a very clear answer just chooses death I guess I guess this is the this is the demo for par paralysis not paralyze of ranges. Right? Okay. I still don't understand the sock thing. The kid, I don't think I can reach that from here, can I? Nah. Not sure how you get to that one.
I am aware. I wouldn't call this just paralyzed, it just seems to wreck highs. Kills whoever it hits and basically kills like the nearest person. More puzzle room. Whatever, running out of environments here or something? I guess this is meant to be a trick, but it's incredibly obvious. So you gotta get into this one. And then paralyze him and then zzzz. So what's this room's deal? Frog Prince Junko Frog loves her Witch or Wizard Junko feeds Frog Weeps for Frog Talks frog into bed. Frog becomes kid. Kid loves Junko. Which kid is this? Is that the artist one? I guess this is his town? I don't know. Is it meant to be that she wouldn't make him ugly anymore or something? Oh, that's why he didn't want to be ugly or whatever. Uh, yeah. Okay, this will be a break on this one, and then well, I'm gonna keep going in the next video. Uh, thank you for.